Hi, this is Sean Chua. Welcome to SimpleChemConcepts.com. Today we're going to discuss a question on mole calculations. Let's take a look at the question. 12 dm cube of polluted air is passed through lime water so that all the carbon dioxide is precipitated as calcium carbonate. The mass of calcium carbonate form is 0.05 grams. So what is the percentage by volume of carbon dioxide in the air sample? For this question, in order to solve it, you need to realize that a balanced chemical equation is required. Let's take a look at the thought process. In the first step, you need to understand that the question is asking you to find the percentage by volume of carbon dioxide in polluted air. And this is governed by the equation of volume of carbon dioxide divided by volume of polluted air sample multiplied by 100%. And in the question, you realize that the volume of polluted air sample is already given as 12 dm cubed. So all you need to do is to find the volume of carbon dioxide from the information given. Let's take a look at the action plan on how to solve it. In the first step, you need to come up with a balanced chemical equation when carbon dioxide reacts with lime water with essentially calcium hydroxide. And in this reaction, you produce the calcium carbonate precipitate, which is a solid, and water. And using mole ratio, you realize that one mole of carbon dioxide you react with one mole of calcium hydroxide to give one mole of calcium carbonate precipitate and one mole of water. So we place this into the equation just below it. Next, we need to plug in the information that's given in the question with 0.05 gram mass of calcium carbonate formed. And with relative molecular mass or the MR of calcium carbonate to be 100, we will apply the mathematical formula of mole equals to mass over MR to give us a value of 0 0.0005 mole of calcium carbonate precipitate that is formed. And using the seesaw method, tracking back, we will know that one mole of calcium carbonate precipitate is formed from one mole of carbon dioxide as a reactant. This essentially means that 0 0.0005 mole of calcium carbonate is formed from 0 0.0005 mole of carbon dioxide. In the next step, we need to calculate the volume of carbon dioxide produced. And this is given as mole multiplied by the molar volume 24 dm cubed per mole. And this essentially gives us a value of 0 0.012 dm cubed. Last but not least, we'll find the answer by plugging all the information that we have into the initial equation that we use which percentage by volume of carbon dioxide in the air sample given at volume of carbon dioxide divided by volume of air sample multiplied by 100%. And this will give us a value of 0.10%. I hope this instruction is clear. For more all levels chemistry tips, phenomenon and exam strategies, please visit us at www.simplechemconcepts.com. Thank you.